Welcome back to Energetically You. This is one of the guided meditation versions of the podcast. I have a special treat for you today. This is actually a part of a resource that I'm creating, which is a five day journaling challenge to rewire your mind to go from imposter syndrome to a CEO mindset. But really, this just helps you uncover your imposter syndrome archetype to stop self-sabotaging in business, in life, or um, really, if there's just some big project or big thing that you feel like you're putting yourself in a potentially emotionally risky place, this is going to help you work through that. So day one of the challenge is called highest self visualization meditation. So find a comfortable seated position. You can be uh, at your desk. If you have um, shoes on, maybe you want to remove them so you can ground your feet. You want to make sure that you're sitting upright and that your crown of your head is in line with your hips You just feel a nice lengthening of the spine. You don't want too much tension. You don't want to be sitting up too tall where you feel like you're in an abnormal, just nice amount of space between each vertebra. And bring your attention to the alignment. See if you can feel your ears in line with your shoulders. Maybe you're leaning a little bit forward or maybe your chin is a little bit forward. Just realigning and finding a comfortable position with your feet and your legs. We're going to start by grounding ourselves by taking three deep breaths with a slight pause at the end of each inhale and each exhale. We're not holding our breath. It's just a little micro pause as the waves go back and forth in the ocean there's always like a microsecond where there's a pause so we're just going to extend that ever so slightly so let's start by inhaling pause exhale Inhale, pause, exhale, pause, a couple more in your own rhythm, inhaling, exhaling. You'll notice that you can do the exhale with the mouth closed or blowing the air out through an open mouth, whichever you find more relaxing, cleansing, and grounding. A couple more breaths. Just coming in. And letting out. Fresh energy in. Stale energy out. Last one. Life energy in. Stress out. Just keep breathing. Your own rhythm. Inhaling and exhaling. And now we're going to start the visualization. We're going to imagine watching ourselves, the highest version of ourselves, or you could think of it as your ideal self five years from now. And what are they doing? And where are they in the world? What are they wearing? Are they alone? Or are they with a group of people? Just a couple individuals? 
what is the environment and where are they located? Are they in an office? Are they in a house? Are they somewhere out in nature? And don't overthink this too much. Just try and go with whatever was the first thing that came to mind. And then we sort of peel back the layers of each of the senses. So once you have some sort of visual, and it might shift and change as we go through this. Now try and notice what do you smell in this environment? Is it fresh? What is the aroma, if any? What can you connect with in terms of the olfactory senses? Are you maybe emitting an aroma, an essential fragrance that you love to use or that you'd love to embody using more? Beautiful. Now let's go more to the feeling, the tactile, the tangible. What's the temperature of where you are? Do you feel hot? Do you feel the perfect temperature? Do you feel cool? Is there a breeze? Is there sun on your face? Are you in the shade? What is the physical feeling of where you envision yourself, your ideal self in five years? Beautiful. Let's go to the next sense. Can you taste anything? Is there anything, any aftertaste in your own mouth maybe? Are you visualizing a cool glass of water beside you? Depending on what you're doing, maybe you're drinking coffee, maybe you're sharing a meal with friends, family. What would be the scene and what might you be tasting? Take a couple more deep breaths. Beautiful. Let's connect with your feet. Do you have shoes on? Are you barefoot? What are you feeling on the bottoms or around your feet? Maybe you're on a beach and you can feel the sand between your toes. Maybe you're in the mountains and you're skiing and your foot is a little bit scrunched up but nice and warm in the ski boot. Maybe you're hiking. What's on your feet and in what way are your feet connecting with the earth at this moment in your visualization? Perfect. Now let's connect with your sense of hearing. What are the sounds in this environment? Are there any birds chirping, any wildlife? Do, if there's a breeze, is it strong? Is there any sort of white noise in the background? Maybe the ocean, the waves? Maybe you're envisioning yourself on a big stage giving a presentation and there's wild applause. What are the sounds that you can drink up from this visualization of your ideal future self? Now, let's go back to what you're wearing. How do these clothes feel on your body? And what's your posture? Are you sitting down? Are you super relaxed? Or are you standing out nice and tall looking over 
at the horizon of you, a sunrise, a sunset, what is the energy that you're embodying? Confidence? Are you at ease? Are you excited? Are you feeling filled up with love? Self trust, self acceptance. And where are you in your body? Do you feel energy around your heart? Or is your mind is going crazy of all these new ideas, projects you want to focus on? Or maybe you're just extremely relaxed connecting with a loved one, what is your ideal self? What is the energy you are embodying and embodying in this vision? Beautiful. So let's focus now on the light. A little bit more specifically, what time of day is it? And what kind of light is hitting you or in the environment that you are in? Is there anything you can notice? Any little bits of awe of nature? Maybe you can see the reflection of something. If there's sun hitting the water. Maybe there's a crystal in the room and it's giving off little rainbows in the reflection Let's do a little scan of this ideal environment where your highest self exists and take away any little tidbits of magic that you notice about the environment, how you feel, smell, hear, taste, and then how you're feeling. What is the energy? that you wish to carry as your highest self five years from now. Let's just take a few more deep breaths and drink all of that in. Beautiful. One last breath. We're going to float our hands together, create a little warmth, a little energy, a little heat. And you're going to seal this visualization by taking those warm hands and covering your eyes. Beautiful. Just absorbing the experience when you're ready coming back out be really powerful to journal which will be another aspect of day one of this journaling challenge so if you wish in the show notes you'll find the link to have this challenge sent to you over five days via email And either way, you can do this visualization as many times as you like, and you can modify it to be, you know, one year from now, or 10 years from now to really use the power of our senses to enrich, enrich, is that a word? No, (laughs) make more powerful your visualization by connecting to all of the senses and the energy in which you want to embody as your highest self. Thanks for listening. Have a good one.